Right, this may shock regular viewers of my videos, but I have no idea what I'm doing. So, apply with a cloth. Do I put it on the cloth or on the wood? Who knows? Yeah, it shouldn't really be there. Right, let's try wood. Uh -oh. Okay, this is bad. There's a big lots of blocks there. Luckily there'll be all sorts of bits and pieces, if you know what I mean. But first, so now, I did. It's going to upset me that. Um, I did kind of sand it a little bit. This bizarre line here. Any thoughts on why that line's there? It's just there to annoy me? Most things are. Okay, I'll pause you and come back when it's done. Right, I'm doing the sides now, and they look much darker. and I'll turn it over. Hang on. You can't really see what I'm doing there. Let me. Getting carried away. This is kind of cool. Pause you there. Okay, doing the back now. Now the colour is very blotchy at the front. Um, sorry, more patchy than blotchy. Uh, I don't know, I'll see what it does when it dries, maybe go over again, I don't know, we'll see, but uh, anyway, that's the idea, I'll just do a little bit more in case there's anyone here who just enjoys watching the wood change colour, I think I'd probably enjoy it, um, I'm quite enjoying what I'm doing, so I'll leave it on, nothing interesting is going to happen in the rest of this video, so uh, if you've, uh, unless you want to watch me do this, you can switch off now. Go and watch some TikToks, people dancing. That made me sound really old, didn't it? Watch some TikToks. There we go. Lovely. That's just, that's smashing, that is. Okay, the wood has died. Let's uh, put on some of this. I bought, over the time, I bought so many different things, different oils and stains and dyes from different people recommending stuff, but I've just, I've gone with the dye and this. Uh, it says apply with a brush. I'm not sure if I pour it onto the brush or just pour it onto here, but let's. Uh, Let's, let's, let's see what it does. It says apply liberally. That's... Okay, that's just drips absolutely everywhere. Make a right mess of this. Smells nice, but I am, I'm wearing good, proper PPE. 
Ooh, that does smell nice. The room is ventilated and I'm wearing PPE, like I said. Um, I need to find a better way of doing this so it doesn't pour everywhere because it's making quite a mess. This is quite cool. Uh, like anyone who's watched any of my other videos knows, I'm, uh, I'm not an expert in any part of this, so this is absolutely trial and error for me. Um, so hopefully that is useful to other people who are equally lacking in expertise. If there's anyone out there who has expertise and says, no, do this, do that, whatever, um, that's helpful for me and others watching. Um, if you want to pass on any any knowledge. Otherwise, people like me will remain completely ignorant as to how to do these things. You know, people don't... Oh, I'm sure I could watch a video. But yeah, I probably should, but I like to sort of have a go myself first. Right, other side, let's go. Did say a generous amount. <laughs> Define generous. That <laughs> looks really nice. That looks really nice. Maybe I'm not an idiot. Maybe I'm a wood finishing god. Years to come, people will come from all over the world to my wood finishing school. Oh man, check that out. Right, I think I'm gonna do a light sanding with this, well, just following the instructions on the back with this glass paper in the morning and then do another coat. See you then. So, after two coats of the dye, two coats of the shellac, there's this big line across i asked various facebook groups they all said it was clearly a bit of glue uh, i haven't managed to fix it at all so i'm going to have to sand it back so that's my next job right let's see where we are yep still not that right i've sanded it down so you can't see the the line anymore it's, it's looking dark so i just i've washed it i've washed all the uh, sand off sand, sawdust sorry so I'm gonna I'm going to um, yeah I'm gonna let it dry and then I'm gonna start dyeing it again and hopefully uh, you can still see the line I'm really disappointed that Coburn sent something out with a big glue I mean I suppose they couldn't see it it wasn't didn't come out until I was tried to dye it let's see right I am pretty excited because after sanding it back I've done one uh, swoop over of dye and look there's no line so I'm going to do one more and then the two coats for shellac and yeah we'll see if eventually it looks a similar colour to the rest of the body there we go nearly done right that's two coats of the dye done time for the shellac Right, time for the last coat of the shellac sanding sealer. There we are, wax finish, about to go on, and then we're done. Right, well, it's, uh, it's done. Just going to do some finishing wax, and then we're all good. Oh, I'm pretty pleased with that. Yeah. Oh. Get some of that, and there we go. Nice. Uh, 
and we're done. Ah, massive bee.